Hello everyone, Trancher Dan here. I hope you're all doing well today. So this is going to be the first video in my Christmas marathon. Um, for those of you who don't know what is happening, basically I haven't uploaded any videos for a couple of weeks, at least at the point that this video is going up. You see, today is Wednesday the 11th of December. I'm filming this. This is the third video I've edited. Um, the first one that I filmed is to do with a gift from a patron, which will go up on Christmas Eve. Yesterday, I film. I didn't film, I edited the videos going up on Christmas Day. This video will go up a day earlier on the 23rd of December. So I'm actually, I'm still filming and editing videos now and they will be going up from the 23rd of December right through, basically, uh, till the new year. So I'm gonna be doing loads of edit, fil like filming and editing now and then I'm gonna take a break over Christmas and I'm just sort of, you know, enjoy uh, the time off. I get three days off. Um, which is good. I'm very grateful that the company I work for have given me Christmas Eve, Christmas Day and Boxing Day off. I will be using those days to relax, spend time with friends and family and just not worry about filming and editing and stuff like that. So um, that's why currently, like I said, today is the 11th of December. I'm going to be filming and editing lots, um, but I won't be uploading anything. I'm going to sort of bulk it all up and then release it one a day over Christmas. So you've all got things to watch whilst you're off work and I can just relax and you know have a bit of a break which I need. Now as you can see by the title I received a gift from Princess Sophie Pink of course. I try and promote her as much as I can. Any ch child that has an interest in sort of creepy crawlies and invertebrates and you know, animals in general I would love to sort of promote that, I think, you know, teach them young um, and hopefully they'll grow up to you know, have a real passion and interest in what we do, basically. And I say we, I don't just mean me, there's myself, many other YouTubers, um, animal keepers, people that go to shows um, that just want to encourage the positive attitude towards animals, keeping animals, caring for them and researching and everything that comes with it. So um, sort of working with Holly is great. and. If you'd like to see her in another video, stay tuned to the video that's going to be up on Christmas Day um, because she appears several times throughout the video, so I hope you'll enjoy that. Um, I won't say what it is, it's, a l it's like six or seven months late. That's a bit of a clue for you. So anyway, I received a gift from Princess Sophie Pink. Um, this is like a Christmas gift, um, I guess. It, um, it says Merry Christmas on it, and I figured I would unbox this and give her a huge shout out. So to Princess Sophie Pink and your family, a huge thank you for this gift, whatever it is. And of course, I hope you've all had a wonderful Christmas. It's been great to spend some time with you um, this year at shows, and hopefully I will see you in 2020. So this is the gift, of course. I'm not gonna show you the top because it has my actual address on, and as usual, I don't like showing people my address because that's just a stupid thing to do on the internet. Um, but she does have it, and she's put a tranche down my address with a Merry Christmas and a picture of a spider. I don't know, I think it looks like an exclamation mark, but then it looks like a spider coming down on, on a web. So it's either an exclamation mark with a spider as the dot, or uh, or just a spider coming down on, on some silk. I don't know. It's really cool anyway. So uh, we're going to open this up and take a look. So I've just opened the box. So there's actually a few things in here that I can see. I'm going to just place this down here. Um, on the very top, there is a Christmas card. I'm just going to show you that. It's a, uh, it's a spider with a Christmas hat on. And it says uh, Princess Sophie Pink down here with her, her logo. This card has been made, so that's, that's really nice. Um, I actually, I think I damaged it a little bit when I was cutting it out, as you can just see up here but uh, that's fine and it's got uh, this is what it says on the on the inside so the right side uh, says uh, to Tarantra Dan Merry Christmas from Holly with a picture of some presents and a sand hat as well as a spider down here not sure what the species is but it's a great job Holly and um, on the other side it says um, dear Dan uh, I hope you have a lovely Christmas I hope you like the gifts I got you I thought the teddy, uh, thought the teddy at first sight looked like your logo, so I had to get it you. Uh, thank you for supporting me. You're amazing. Uh, love from Holly. Trancher Dan is the best. 
So I think that definitely is probably one of the best sort of fan mails that I've got. Of course, you know, Holly is wonderful. I have the keying of her and uh, yeah, I, again, like you, you see it in the f video coming up on Christmas Day. She's a wonderful girl and um, it's great to know you and you're awesome too. So thank you very much for that. I'm gonna put that. Um, actually, you know, I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna put that downstairs in my living room with my Christmas cards. By the way, that's actually the first Christmas card that I received this year. So uh, Holly, thank you very much. Inside the box, I can already see something on the top, which looks absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, so this is uh, the picture, which again, you'll see in the, in the video from BTS, there's a frame in here. And then uh, there's a picture of, of course, uh, this, um, this gentleman here, which of course is myself, with uh, Princess Sophie Pink. Wearing her Princess Sophie Pink t-shirt. I don't normally wear my Trouncher Dan uh, t-shirts when I go to shows. Um, I'm usually wearing the Spider Shop one, but that is wonderful. And again, I mean this, I don't know. Um, Holly, what do you think? I will leave this up to you. I can either have this in this room on a shelf somewhere, or I can put this in my living room and then anyone that comes around to my house, can uh, they can see this. So I will leave that one up to you where you want me to place it. Animal room or in, the, in my living room. But for now, I will put that, um, I need to move some stuff. I think you can see that. So yeah, I'll put it there for now. And I'll put the box back up here. Okay. I think this is the spider that you spoke about, a very colorful spider. Definitely looks like a huntsman. Um, you can see it's, uh, Got uh, wire legs. Oh, I need to find something. This has to go in the animal room. I can't keep it out of sight of Ramsey, my beardy, because she'll, she'll try and eat this. Willing to, uh, to put money on it. Okay, that's the wrong leg. That one goes down and that one goes up. Um, so a super colorful rainbow, uh, rainbow tarantula. Uh, this really needs to go on show somewhere. I don't know whether I need a bigger animal room for things. The, the problem I have at the moment is I have this shelf up here that's for um, sort of gifts and, and things that I receive. As you can see, I got my Spyro and uh, I got this Spyro, uh, Spyro, this spider from uh, Genius Tarantulas and uh, my skeleton and I have sort of fan mail on sort of this wall around here. Um, I need to put this somewhere where it's visible. So I think I might just have to have a little bit of a move around. I think I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have, yeah. I'm gonna have to have a move around off camera, I think, because it's gonna be quite awkward to do um, with this room being in the state that it is at the moment. Um, because of rehousings and things like that. So uh, for now, oh, actually, I know where I can put this. I can, I, if I can glue this, I can. I don't want to glue this because it, it might it get stuck. Um, hmm. So I've put that spider above my whiteboard. Uh, from here I can see, it's, obviously it's not in vid shot at the moment, but I will have to have a move around and uh, then maybe clear out all of this to get more 
make more space for, for things like that. So, but for now it's gonna be above the whiteboard so I can always see it and uh, yeah, that's really, really cool. That's actually the biggest spider that I have in my room now. So um, that's awesome. I love it, really, really nice. Thank you very much. And then finally, um, there's this wonderful little book. Uh, it says, um, totally amazing facts about creepy crawlies. And on the inside of this book, there's some really good uh, posts. Uh, there's some, not even just like the kind of bugs that, and insects or creepy crawlers that I would sort of keep. For example, um, on page five, uh, four and five is head lice. Um, I'm sure at some point we've all had head lice when we were younger. Absolutely horrible little, little things. Um, Atticus atlas, the atlas moth, of course, I've had those in the past. Um, let's see what else. Oh, da -da -da. I think mm. orchid mantis, of course, I've had those. Dragonflies, absolutely love, love dragonflies. Luna moth, I've had those as well in the, uh, in the, in the past. Don't have many. I don't have any amphibians, which is uh, a shame. I should maybe look at getting some kind of um, some kind of amphibians in the future. Right. John Wick Spider. Again, is a John Wick Spider. It says here that Antarctica is the only continent that does not have spiders. So uh, hopefully that's something that uh, you may have learned from this video. Also. Jumping spiders can leap up to 50 times their body length, which is insane if you think of a man that's six foot being able, you know, to jump uh, 50 times their body length. That would be pretty impressive. Yeah, I think that's... I just made Una jump. Sorry, Una. I think that's a perfect book for me. I actually have uh, an area in my bedroom where I keep all of the books that I'm currently reading and other books that I'm not reading straight away will go into um, the spare room but um, yeah this will be upstairs in my bedroom I think I'll have a look at this and see what else this book can teach me uh, I'm sure there's gonna be plenty in here that I don't know because although I like to know as much as I can about spiders and the things that I keep you know I'm not that familiar with um, you know like here for example cicadas um, I said out that humans can hear them from 0.8 kilometers or half a mile away so I didn't know that exact figure before now. So straight away, turning a page at random, I have learned a piece of information. So uh, to Princess Sophie Pink and your family, uh, once again, a huge thank you for this. This is a really, really nice um, selection of gifts. And I honestly cannot thank you enough. I think it's really, really wonderful that you've taken the time to, to get this. And by the way, to anyone, I'd like to just point out that uh, Holly actually saw this and asked her mom for it and wanted to to pay for it with her pocket money, I believe. So, um, yeah, Holly is a really, really sweet little girl, and I would really encourage all of you to go and check her out. Um, there will be an annotation at the end of this video to one of her videos. I'll also put a uh, annotation to her channel in the end, a link in the description, and the same will be said for the. Um, there'll be some cards for her in the video on Christmas Day. So please. Go and check her out, you know, lovely little girl, heart of gold, and I'd love for you to go and check her out and just say that, you know, that uh, you came from my channel, just so um, she knows that, you know, that you've seen this. So I, th I think it's wonderful. It's really, really nice. I feel bad because I've actually opened this Christmas present early. I don't know whether I should have waited till Christmas or not, but at the same time, I didn't know what was in it. So, you know, I, you know, because the, the thing is obviously, uh, you know, her parents sent it to me. They didn't send it to Santa Claus. So he didn't deliver it to me. It came straight to my house. So that's why I've opened it early. So um, yeah, uh, thank you very much. I, I really appreciate it. I really hope that you all have a wonderful Christmas. Please stay tuned for the rest of the videos. Don't forget to check out um, Princess Sophie Pink's channel. And uh, yeah, have a good one everyone. Take care. And I'll see you soon in the next video. Take care and goodbye from me.